All right. Um, I think I've set everything up. Um, the tournament. Um, I can't really. You have to set a certain time for some tournaments. So uh, I've set I've set it for um, what is it? Set it for eleven o'clock, which is in about a quarter of an hour. You can't really do quarters of an hour. You have to do half hours. So. Uh, It'll start in, uh, it'll start, yeah, it'll start at the start of the hour, basically. But uh, that should give people enough time to practice, which is what I'm doing right now. Uh, I don't know if the, if the room code will come up at any point, but, um, I'll put it up on the screen if it doesn't. So, yeah, it'll be called the Garrido Open. Uh, let's go with Navy Yosh. Again, I'm not sure if this is a, <laughs> if this is an optimal build, but um, it's what I use. Oh god, I need to change the thing to say thing. America Eight Deluxe. There we go. Right. Yeah, not sure if this is the best build, but I never really pay much attention to the stats. I just uh, I just tend to ride whatever feels right to me. Right, so at the moment we can do like practice matches. Again, I don't know if anyone saw the uh, the room code, so I might just put it up on the screen. Let's see text. Okay. Select the font. Right, that should do, I think. Two, nine, three, yeah. three, nine, nine, zero, three. Give me a sec. Yeah, uh, where about should I put this? Um, Need to shrink it first, obviously. Um, hang on. Transform bit to screen. There we are. That makes it a bit easier to manage. Oh god, what have I done? No, that that's something else. Right, yeah, there we go. That that's the room code. That's not the best font. Uh, let's just um, let's just go with the default. Oh god. No. Uh, oh wait, you can select front from here. Okay, that that helps. What about that? that? There we go. That that looks better. There we go. That's the room code. Stick it up here above my guy. Waiting for everyone to vote for a course. I, I've already voted. Um, hang on. Yeah, go back. <laughs> uh, tournament. Garrido Open. Oh yeah, see, it's, it's down there. It's down... Yeah, that is right. Okay, cool. You ranking. Oh yeah, no ranking available because no one's entered yet. Right, uh, tournament's currently closed, but you can still play practice matches. Results will not count towards your ranking. Rank will open. Right. Uh, Rainbow Road. Right, do I need, do I need to wait for? other people to actually jump into this. Maybe I should set some uh, CPU opponents just so I have something to race against. Uh, 
Okay, symbol for tournament. Yeah, that's fine. Three door open, yeah. Okay, uh... We'll just have easy CPU so they're not dominating. Well, no, normal CPU would be fair, I guess. There we go. So hopefully... Okay, the room, the room code is still the same. That's good. So I don't need to alter that. Join. Tournament's currently closed. Join Greedo open. Right. And I finally get a match going. Dragon Drift Way. No, I actually need to wait for other people to join in. Oh god. Uh, <laughs> please join. Please join my my room. Please. <laughs> uh, it, it it's right here. If if you can join her, that would be great. <laughs> please. I did not think this one through. If, if I don't get anyone by uh if nobody else joins by mid, by uh, by eleven, then I'll probably move over to to Pokemon because at least then I know I can get some matches in. <laughs> I'll just <laughs> I'll just wait around. I thought I'd be able to like practice against CPUs at least. Let me just check these two cards. Oh, okay, yeah, they are the promos. Okay. Alright. <laughs> uh, okay, let's just fuck around with this, the soundboard a bit. You know, they say all men are created equal, but you look at me and you look at Small Joe, and you can see that statement is not true. See, normally if you go one on one with another wrestler, you got a 50 50 chance of winning. But I'm a genetic. I'm me. <laughs> and I'm not normal. So you got a 25% at best at beating me. And then you add Kurt Angle to the mix, your chances of winning drastically go down. See, the three way at sacrifice, you got a 33 and a third chance of winning. But I, I got a 66 and two thirds chance of winning because Kurt Angle, Angle knows, knows he can't, he can't beat, me, beat me and he's not and he's even going to try. Gonna try. So, small Joe, you take your 33 and a third chance, <laughs> minus my 25% chance, and you got an 8 and a third chance of winning at sacrifice. But then you take my 75% chance of winning, if we used to go one on one, and then add 66 and two thirds percent, chance, percent. I got 141 and two thirds chance of winning at sacrifice. See, Joe, the numbers don't lie, and they spell disaster for you at sacrifice. Oh yeah, th this one seems appropriate. Come on everyone, do the oil ram! Hello, Void. <laughs> Hello, darkness, my old friend. I've come to talk with you again. This is my brain right now. Uh. 
and I'll get you next time, cheater. I'm the only one here. You might as well just go for my course. Hello? 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 <laughs> Hello? <laughs> I'm just hoping this doesn't happen too much <laughs> on the stream. Oh, what, what am I looking at? Okay, that was weird. <laughs> Staring off into the void. I think after the tournament officially opens, I'll wait another five minutes, and if uh, if nobody else enters, I'm I'm probably going to switch over. <laughs> Looking at my watch. Looking at my watch, son. It's three sixteen time. <laughs> no. Okay. Pingers. I wasn't concentrating, and I paid for that. I also like to live dangerously. <laughs> I could just start a whole conversation with all these fucking sound bites. Uh Amazing. Hello. <laughs> right. You know what? I'm just gonna do a yeah. I'm gonna do an online race and I'll come back. I'll come back to this tournament. Oh god, hang on. There we go. Uh, do a global race. Yeah, just just do that. I'll come back into the tournament in a little while. I imagine once it officially opens, it will. Uh, some people will start um, trickling in. Okay, so I'm, uh, I'm spectating a match at the moment, looks like. Okay. Let's say I'll hop back in afterwards. Oh, it's 11 o'clock now. Hmm. Yeah, I'll do one race from Global and then... I'll check to see how the tournament's doing. Are they all they still on the first lap? Just a word of warning, I'm not like a massive pro at this game. 
Like, I've seen I've seen people pull off some stuff that I've never seen, and for the life of me, I can never can never imitate any of the stuff. I I tend to just go um, you know in the path that I know. I don't think I know that many tricks to these sorts of stages. But fingers crossed I don't do too badly. I just fell off the stage. <laughs> Not sure what happened there. Yeah, hopefully the Wi-Fi holds out. I did do a test of this, um, I think yesterday, to see if the the Wi-Fi would be stable. It looks like it is. All right, what do I want? Um, Mario Kart Stadium, I guess. I'm only going to stick around for one race. And then go back to my tournament. Right, can we hurry this along, please? I have a tournament to go to. <laughs> Okay, yes, come on, hurry up. All spin selected, nice. All right. <laughs> Should have done this a bit sooner, but oh well. Like I say, I'll play this match and dip from global and then go back to the tournament screen, see how that's going. Let's go. Oh god, I <laughs> drifted too soon there. I'll say I'm very rusty when it comes to this game. I only got the single power up thing. It's fine. It's good. Alright, keep out of Alex's way. Oh, now I have a horn. Time to make some noise. Keep rolling, 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 what? Make some noise! Oh god. He didn't even use his, his horn there. Okay, uh... Drag this behind me. Oh wow, triple shells. Okay, take this! Oh. It's no use! Ow! Lightning. Lightning imprisoning me! All that I see! No. Doesn't quite work. What? Oh! Communication error. Um, shit. I hope that wasn't me. Alright, online play. Connecting. 
tournament. Here we go, Greedo open. Join. Yes, come on. Now are there people in it? No. <laughs> oh, fuck's sake. Uh, Hyrule Circuit? All right, uh... Hmm... What do I do? <laughs> Hi. Hello. <laughs> This is pathetic. Oh, <laughs> uh, okay. Um, I feel like this probably would have gone off better if I had announced something beforehand, but I didn't know I'd have enough time for it. It was just something... I think I thought of um, off the top of my head, but um, yeah. <laughs> All right. Um, I'll wait until ten past, and if uh, nobody else enters, then I'll probably just scrap the whole thing. <laughs> now I'll just do some ranked Pokemon. Two minutes. Two minutes. I'll need to plan this thing out um, better in future, I think. One minute. I don't think anyone else is going to join. Would have thought making it an open tournament would, um... Nah, they're probably, uh, <laughs> playing on some other tournaments. Yeah, if I ever want to do anything like this again, I'll have, I'll have to announce it way, way beforehand. Alright, five, four, three, two, one, cancel. Okay. Yep, and uh, might as well delete this. Uh, can I not delete it? I don't know. Um. Okay, I can't I can't delete it. Um huh. Oh well, um 
I guess tournament's there for anyone who wants to use it, but I won't be going in there. All right. So, uh, lesson learned there. All right, let's do this. Let's see, Pokemon Sword and Shield. Here we are. Twitch just tagged this as an open world game. It's not an open world game. It's trash. Shut up. I mean, yeah, it's not the best Pokemon game ever made, but it's not that bad, come on. <laughs> anyway, yeah. Not sure how many matches this will do. I'm also thinking I might try and uh, get rid of the whole box of Charmanders that have been in, in here since since last November. Because I did try, plan to uh, trade these away uh, during a birthday stream, like, months and months ago, but obviously that didn't happen. It's a good thing it didn't as well, because my internet was shit back then. Yeah, might see if I can get rid of those after a couple matches. Might even draft a team based on uh, what I get. Oh wait, no, why am I on local communication? No. That's not gonna work. Alright. Let's see, versus... Uh, battle Stadium. Ranked battles. You can't Dynamax in this uh, in this season of ranked battles, I've noticed. Which kind of fucks my team up a bit. There's a lot of them have G-Max forms. But we'll see how we get on. We have Paige the Intellion. Titan the Colossal. I think that was Pharrell the Toxtricity. All-Star, the Grimmsnarl, Ramsey's the Runerigus, and I think, I'm think i trying to think what I called the Horlucha. It's a male one. Uh, Guerrero, I think it was? Yeah. Pretty sure I called it Guerrero. Get the Battle Tower music on because I like that. I love me some Toby Fox. Alright, opposing train has been found. We battling. Oh god, I can't. It. Hmm. Didn't even have enough time to read that. Uh. Hmm. Alright, so what do I want to bring? Obviously, I'll kick things off with Intellion. Uh Bell Toxtricity would be a good shout. Hmm. Oh, I have a couple ghost types. Uh I 
Maybe I'll bring Remstall in as well. And Toxtricity to deal with the uh, Serene and Clefable, I think. Yeah, this should do. And the unfortunate thing is, I don't think my Grimstall has a fairy type move. Could be wrong. Uh, it's been a while since I've checked this team. <laughs> There's probably another reason why I'm uh, probably not going to do very well here. Alright, so I kick things off for a Frost Lass. Fine by me. I will go for a Dark Pulse. Let's see what they do. Right. Telling gets the Dark Pulse off. Gets the one hit knockout. There we go. So, what's next? If there's something that resists Dark Pulse, I might have to switch out. For some choice specs. This is... Ah. Okay. Yeah. Definitely switching out here. So I'll switch out into Pharrell, the Toxtricity. Go sort of rapid spin. Okay. So their speed goes up one. Can they handle a sludge bomb? Or will they switch out? Or will they be able to pull off a move? I don't know. We'll see. We'll go for the power whip. Not very effective. Knocks me down to half though. Now, can they survive a sludge bomb? No, they can't. Three one so far. And they send out Clefable. Ooh. I think we got this one. Unless Clefable is able to do something here. Nope, I get the sludge bomb. Oh, the fairy just barely able to eat that. Goes for a moonblast. Interesting strategy. Doesn't quite pay off. Hmm. No, I don't. Hmm. Maybe. I'll go for an overdrive. Oh, the battle's getting... Oh, okay. <laughs> so they forfeited that one, I guess. They've given up. They're sick of feeling. Is there nothing you can't say? Uh, had to get one of those in. Even though this isn't a monster answer stream. Do you want to check the opponent? No, no, I'm good, thanks. Take some time for the results to be updated. You want to continue battling? Yeah, let's do a couple more. Hmm? Closing trainer has been found. A battle against John is about to start. Okay. What do you got for us, John? Alright, so it looks like it should be safe to start off with Intellion again. Gengar. Hmm. My champ. Hmm. Interesting. Definitely want to bring in Titan. And, 
Yeah, let's bring Rune Regress as well. Well, no, Grim. Mm, no. Uh. Now, fuck it. I'll bring. I'll bring Guerrero, the Halucha. <laughs> Same pose. Good taste. Alright, so he brings up Gengar first. Perfect. Delete a Dark Pulse, unless he decides to switch out to something else. Here we go, here's the Dark Pulse. How much does it do? Oh! Are we hung on with the uh, Focus Sash? Ah, oh, man. And Dark Pulse is disabled. Ah, oh, that's really going to mess me up. Ah. Alright, so I'm going to have to switch here. Hmm. I'll go into Titan, I think. It's probably the smartest move. Thunderbolt! Doesn't do much. Oh wow, that was a critical hit as well. Okay, let's go for a Flare Blitz. I don't think the recoil is going to do too much. Focus Blast! Oh, but it avoided. Oh wow. Okay, there goes the Flare Blitz. Good. Good stuff. Alright, so we're in the lead so far. But that all can change. Brings in Cinderace now. Hmm. Kinda wanna try going for a Stone Edge. Yeah, I'll go for a Stone Edge. High Jump Kick. Oh god, now it's turned into a fighting type. Oh, ah! Oh. Okay, take some damage from the rocky helmet, but that, that's fine, that's fine. We're good. Uh. Alright, come on, Guerrero. Or Lucha, the Tower Master. Alright, so now it's a fighting type. Brave, Brave Bird will be super effective. Use Bounce. Oh god. Alright. Oh no. Hmm. Alright, I think I'm going to have to uh, sacrifice Paige here. Probably not the best thing to do, but oh well. Not much you can do really with a, with a 5 HP Intellion. Alright, I'm probably going to guess he's going to go for that again. Not really a lot I can do about that, but I guess I guess I'll set up with a sword stance. Yeah, he's, go, he's going for it again. Spraying up. I don't know if Guerrero has, an, Guerrero has enough to... Uh, to endure that. But we shall see. Indoris goes to the bounce, and yeah, there we go, knocks him out. Okay, that's fa that's fair enough. I can take a loss. <laughs> I lost to John. I lost to John.
Ninja Race is a tricky one. It's the uh, it's the Greninja of our generation, of this generation, at least. Uh, now continue battling. Opposing trainer has been found. Battle against Gavin, rank one. All right. Hmm. Ah, interesting. Fle Fletchinder and a Pupitar. Huh. I'm guessing the Garchomp, the uh, Drake of... I'm guessing the Fletchinder and the Pupitar are just uh, space fillers. Hmm. I wonder what do I want to go with against this sort of team. I feel like Guerrero has to come in. And, uh, hmm. Hmm. Uh. Hmm. Yeah, no, not Colossal or Toxtricity. Um... Let's bring Ramses in. So it starts off with Dracovish. Hmm. I guess I'll go with an Ice Beam. The ba what? What? Okay. Huh? The match only just started, though. What? Hmm. Right. Uh, no, no thanks. Let's continue battling. <laughs> what the hell happened there? Opposing trainer has been found against. Uh, uh, I'm terrible with my uh, hiragana. All right. Of Intellion. Um, I feel like Rune Rigos would only be useful against the Raichu. Bring in Pharrell. Uh... Hmm. Page, Pharrell, Ramses. Let's go. Alright, so kicks things off with Raichu. Uh, is Paige quick enough to uh, to outspeed a Raichu, I wonder? Let's do a U-turn anyway. It's probably a bad idea. I should... Okay, we get the U-turn. 
Alright, so Paige comes back to me. I can now swap out to Ramses. The Thunderbolt has no effect. And uh, let's go for an Earthquake straight away. Oh god. I, I forget Raichu's going to actually learn Surf without having to go through a whole bunch of bullshit. But it doesn't do a lot of damage anyway, so we're all good. The Earthquake knocks out the Raichu. Alright, and Ramses regains some of its health with the leftovers. Let's see, what do you bring him next? You set him up, I'll knock him down. Oh, go lurk. Ground ghost versus ground ghost. What a match. Alright, I'll go for a Will-O-Wisp. Oh, God, wow. Going for an Earthquake. Doesn't quite do enough. Now it's Will-O-U. I don't think... I don't... No. I don't really want to go for... Top. Ah! Lumberry heal that's burn. Uh, fair enough. Okay, well, at least let's use that now. Still trying to go for the Earthquake. Alright, this will wear it down some. I'm going to regenerate some of its health with the leftovers. Get the burn. And let's set up a Stealth Rock. That Earthquake isn't going to do as much damage as it used to. Right, we're just going to have uh, Ramses set up here until it eventually faints. Have a layer of stealth rocks. Go look, goes for the earthquake. Oh, and he gets it this time. Okay. Cool. That's fine. Set up one layer of rocks. Weaken the go lurk. Definitely don't want to go into <laughs> go into Pharrell, so uh Yeah, Intellion is the best play here. And let's just go for a nice safe surf. The Raichu has been dealt with, so there's no more threats to Intellion now. Alright, down goes the Go Lurk. And now, what is this final mon? It's the Unpheasant. I could just knock it out with Surf. I can't use Ice Beam because I'm choiced into Surf. Right, there we go. I think I'll do one more match and then I'll probably do some surprise trades. No, I don't want to check with the opposing team. Thanks. Is any battling? Alright. One more match. One more match. Congratulations on going up in rank. Here's some BP to commemorate this event. Alright.
Losing Shrine has been found. Battle against... Oh god, I, I really need to get back into... Uh, what's it called? Duolingo. Uh, oh god, there's a lot of Dragon types. No, there's two Dragon types. It's barely a lot. I'm pretty sure I can take advantage of those with Grimmsnarl. Uh, hmm. Psychic type and Mewtwo as well. Um, mm, mm, mm. Huh. Might just bring Guerrero for the Zoroark. Uh, but I kind of. Mm. No. I'm pretty sure my Grimmsnarl should have a fairy type move. I think it's a dark type move it's lacking. It's mostly all set up moves. I'll, I'll go with Pharrell. There we go. Communication with the other trainer was interrupted. Fuck's sake. <laughs> All right. I I didn't even get to see that match, so I don't know. All right, come on. Maybe they're thinking because this looks like a this looks like a a story team. They're thinking, eh, fuck this. He's a scrub. I'm not playing no scrubs tonight. <laughs> All right. Pharrell and uh, hmm. Hmm. Uh, what do I want to do here? Grim Snarl, okay. So, Paige, Pharrell, and... All-Star, I think it was. Jojo. Is that a Jojo reference? Alright, Jojo sends out Corsola. Interesting, this must be one of those Eevee like Corsolas I've been hearing so much about. Let's see how well it takes a Dark Pulse. Oh wow, that does half health. Stealth Rock, oh dear. This could be bad. Alright, let's just go for another Dark Pulse. Mind you, what, what did I bring? No, neither of those are weak to rock. We should be fine with at least one layer of Stealth Rock. Right. That knocks the Corsola down. I feel like this job has been done. Just a good job I don't have a focus band on any of these guys. Otherwise that would be useless right about now. Right, goes for Dragapult. We do realise I'm choiced into Dark Pulse, right? Dark Pulse is super effective against your Dragapult. So unless you outspeed... Oh, okay. Shadow Ball. Interesting. Oh god. Oh, he was life orbed. That, that makes sense. Still, not sure why you'd go for that. Don't Dragapults get Thunderbolt. 
Surely you would have gone for that. Urshifu. Right, this looks like a rapid strike, so it's a... Yeah. Mm, let's see, rapid strike is... Fighting water, I think? Let's see. Yeah, fighting water. Hmm. Well, at this point, um, Paige has done all she can, so I'll just... I'll stay in to scout whatever this thing might have. Aqua Jet. Fair enough. Let's keep Dark Pulsing away. Another Aqua Jet. Is he choiced into that? Alright, let's bring Pharrell in here. He'll take damage from the Stealth Rocks. That's fine. And let's go for an Overdrive. When I go into Maximum Overdrive! Oh god, Surging Strikes. Oh, wow. That was a... Oh god. Okay. All right. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, wow. We're all barely holding on. The overdrive gets the win. Yeah, I think I can easily call it there. I beat a legendary, so that's good for me. <laughs> I beat Jojo. I have defeated anime. Thank you for continuing to play rank battles, come into my rank, calcium, cool. Alright, I'll quit battling and surprise trade those Charmanders. And I'll probably use that to... to draft my next... <laughs> so, are you saying anime was a mistake? <laughs> No, no, I, I'm not saying that. I, I, I just say I'm just saying I defeated a guy called Jojo. His um, his card pose was a Jojo reference. So um, in a way, I defeated Jojo, defeated the anime Jojo. <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah, uh, these Charmanders. I was gonna surprise trade away during a birthday event, but I never end up doing that stream. Which is why they're all holding bottle caps. If you're a competitive player, you know what bottle caps do. So I figured, like, if anyone got that, they would know. <laughs> they would appreciate that. I think you can, like, fuse four of them together to make a gold ball cap, and that will max out all of your Pokemon stats. I think that's how it works. I don't know. I've never done hyper training in this game. I've usually bred all of my monsters. Yes, I'm, I'm that sad. I actually take the time to breed my Pokemon. <laughs> anyway, yeah. Um, these have been sitting in my uh, in my box for a while. So I figured I might, might as well trade them. And I think I might make this a tradition. Um, like every, t every once in a while, after I've done a bunch of games in, uh, in uh, Ranked, I will breed... Some of my MVP monster, and yeah, and, and then I'll draft the team based on what I get in return. Probably not going to include legendaries because they're such a pain to sort out as compared to bread monsters. All right, so sending Cl Charmander to Chloe. What do we get in return? Ooh, uh, Duosion, I think? That could be cool. I always always did like, um, what was it called? Reuniclus? I think it's its evolved form. That could be fun. Right. If anyone watching has some uh, 
some random Pokemon just sitting in their boxes. Just feel free to chuck them in uh, in surprise trade. Who knows? Maybe we'll find each other on this. <laughs> It can just be any old thing. Right, um... Trying to work out what that is. Su... Suchi? I don't, I don't know. It, it's been a while since I've studied Hiragana and Katakana. Oh, Toxel? Iru. Iru. I, I don't know. Some symbols I recognize, some I don't. Oh, wow. Okay, so that one's definitely been bred. Oh, that... No, that looks like it was caught in like a... A max den, I'm guessing. No, this one looks bred, because it's a level one and it's got... Three best stats. Cool. Alright, come on. Uh, Kyoshi... No, no, no. I, I cannot pronounce that. Maybe I should do a Duolingo stream at some point. <laughs> Alright, oh wow, a Lipard. Nice, nice. The way I like to build my teams is like, I like to have Pokemon of all unique types. Like, no two Pokemon on my team should have the same typing. That, that's just the way I am. <laughs> Alright, come on. Let's do donuts while I wait. <laughs> I'm running in your building. What can you do about it? Look at me go! <laughs> Fuck's sake. Oh, Liam. Will we be trading with Liam? Trading Charmander to Liam. Or oh, Sigilyph. Right. Not my favourite Pokemon design, or Pokemon in general, but yeah, still cool. Oh wow. Oh this one must must have come from a from a raid den then. Four max stats. It's a level 65. Yeah, that must have come from a den. Soup. <laughs> I'm at soup. What do you mean you're at soup? I mean, I'm at soup. Which star are you in? God. Classic. And super sent me a throw. Neat. That's a throw, isn't it? The blue one's Sork, if I remember correctly. Eh. I guess that was just freshly caught in the wild. <laughs> Not that I'm complaining. 
can always just breed one uh, I already own. Jelly butt, what a name. Match me, curl, match me, curl, make me a match. Find me, I find. Catch me, I catch. Come on. Slick butter. Okay. What am I getting from slick butter? Pseudo Wudo? Neat. Oh, it's in a repeat ball. Ugh. <laughs> May as well be in a Pokeball or nothing. Oh god. That one's in a. Yeah. Fucking quick balls. I mean, they're great for finding Pokemon for your Pokedex, but do not fucking send it. <laughs> Luxury balls I'll accept because they look cool, but yeah. They were an ap apricorn ball, pokeball, or nothing. Or like great ball. No, not even great ball. Great balls kind of suck. I should really do like a tier list <laughs> of uh, my favorite pokeballs. It's a shame you can't breed master balls onto anything. You breed a Pokemon that was um that was caught in a Master Ball, the offspring just gets a regular old Pokeball. Uh, I wanted a Flex. I wanted a, I want a fully trained Master Ball Charizard or something. Roulette. Interesting. What do I get from Roulette? Oh, a Zigzagoon. Look at a Hoenn region Zigzagoon. Uh, that's something else to think about. Should I only stick to the regional variants that I get, or yeah, I suppose so. That makes it fairer. I guess if I wanted to draft a Zigzagoon in, it would have to only be a Linoon. Uh, again, I, I'm struggling to read that name. I know that last Patakana is Row. Oh wow, Firestarter for Firestarter. You're the Firestarter. Twisted Firestarter. Uh... Okay. Right. Next one. Panic. At the disco? What was that? Turtle Man. Turtle Man. Right, we get a tour call from Panic. Neat. Turtle man. <laughs> Drought. Eh, okay. Respectable. Sam. You crack me up, little buddy.
Oh wow, a Viker Vault. Well, now that would be cool. I think these things get levitate, so that could be a ground immunity. Yeah, levitate. Cool. I mean, it's not great stat-wise, but I'm pretty sure I have some of my own I can breed. If I want to use Viker Vault on the team. I'll have to look at these and see what kind of teams I can make with them. <laughs> Alright, Momo up next. What do you got for us? Oh, uh, Tootle. <laughs> I love his stupid little face. Right. Yeah, this one looks like it's freshly caught. Spanish. Habla Espanol? Habla Espanol? I, I don't know. I, I speak no Spanish. Abla Spaniel, I think. I think that's Marco. Marco! <laughs> of course. There had to be one, didn't there? Mini Senj. Is that, is that like a regional name for Rookadi? Uh, French. Oui, oui. Uh -huh. Aha. <laughs> Sorry. Alright, uh I can't I can't read that. Definitely need to brush up my Japanese again because I cannot read those symbols. Ooh, a ferroseed? Nice, I do like Ferrothorn. It's a good defensive Pokemon. Iron Barbs plus Rocky Helmet equals massive damage for opponents. Oh. Okay, not bad. Neo Nixia. Interesting name. Will they send anything interesting, is the question. Will I send you a Charmander? You send me a Charmander. <laughs> Fair enough. Oh, I sent a Beast Ball. Nice. I do like the design of the Beast Ball. Again, I think it's just because, like... The whole grid uh, <laughs> pattern on it. I do like my uh, my grids. <laughs> it's just such a cool design in general. Like when it gets thrown, the uh, the Pokemon comes out and like lightning sparks come out of it. That's pretty cool. Oh, wow. I, I don't even see who I didn't... Rena. Okay. They sent me a Renamon. <laughs> Could you imagine? Well, Stuffle? He wears another good bulky Pokemon.
Yeah, I'm kind of gutted that Dynamaxing um, was kind of outlawed in this, uh, well, I guess not outlawed, but you know, it's not legal in this season of Ranked. I do like that, it adds a bit more of a sort of like a... If you're on the ropes, it can really help you out. And there are some times where I just get dominated and can't do anything about it, because... Yeah. Oh, Litwick. Throw... something. God. Plain body, cool. I mean, not that it matters what abilities they have, because I, I have plenty of these Pokemon in my boxes already. I can just breed from. So it's all just a matter of like picking what I want and then just breeding what I have. All right, so it looks like we'll be trading with Tyler next. What do we get from Tyler? Hippopotus. Okay, cool. Getting a lot of bulk, it looks like. It's our first ground type. That's supposed to say Phantom. Oh. Leo Leo? I'm just gonna go Leon, but no. <laughs> just Leo. Alright, sending Charmaine to Leo. Please be a turtle of some sort. <laughs> that would be hilarious. Oh, okay. A Morelul. Alright, 10 more Charmanders. No, 12 more Charmanders to send out. What do we get? Adam? Oh god. <laughs> it's one of those. Do not go to that site. Ah, oh, god, we get... <laughs> I should be excited about this, but, um, really, there's no, like... Oh, well, is that the one I was... I think that's one I was missing from a Pokedex, actually. So that's actually quite good. I mean, it's... It's kind of shit that, uh... <laughs> I end up getting a hacked Pokemon, but, um... Yeah, you, you can't help that, really. I finally have Regieleki from a Pokedex. Which means I can finally do the Regigigas event. Okay, uh, thanks, I guess? Oh, it's holding an ability patch. I might link that off of it. Alright. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Bloody Jenners. Saying I'm not too hyped about getting stuff like that, and then they give me the one Pokemon I was missing from my Pokedex. Still, kind of shit, it's a hacked, but what can you do at the end of the day? Alright, Nicholas sends a Vulpix of the Cantonian variety.
you know, I, I do feel like these um, these things that trade out hacked Pokemon do kind of cheapen the experience. But I guess as long as they as long as they're able to send them in a way that's not going to fuck up somebody's game. Like I know there was a situation months and months ago where people were sending out Pokemon and they ended up completely bricking some people's saves or something, like or made it so they couldn't access online features. Anyway, uh, we just got a wishy washy from that last trade. We're getting a lot of bulky mons. Sonic Fan, 1994. I think this guy was born in the 90s. Oh, okay. <laughs> We're trading with Sword instead. Oh, uh, what is that? A Goth Eater? Goth uh, It's a. Go mo. Uh, uh, no. <laughs> Go something moo. I don't know. Aaron. All right, what are you getting with Aaron? An onage. Like my hunt. Oh wow, it's in a level ball. Do I have a level ball onage yet? Now I have a Moon Ball one. Honestly, I kind of like that one better though. Yeah, level Ball is pretty cool for it as well. Yeah, it kind of works with Dub Blade, but not so much for the uh, what's it called, Iger Slash. Mm, yeah, maybe it does. I don't know. <laughs> I have to think about that one. So yeah, I know. I think I need to change the uh, the color of the, the level ball on the desk thing that I use during the outros and intros. I know the colors are a bit off. I was just going by memory when I was coloring that, but never got around to fixing it. <laughs> right, come on. When does AEW Rampage start, by the way? Is it on now, or is it in about an hour or so? I can never tell the American times. Okay, sending Charmander with Isabella. Oh wow, another... Another Hoenian Zigzagoon? I think they say people people in the UK can watch uh, Rampage on Fight TV. I'm not sure if that's live or what. I have to have a look after the stream. I think. All right, only a few Charmanders left to send out. Looks like we're trading with Kimberly. Oh, please, please be an Aerodactyl. That would be so perfect. Ah, it's a Lapras. That's cool. It's in a quick ball. Oh, I've got plenty that are in, like, I think, lure balls, love balls. I think I've even got beast ball Lapras. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. Best in special attack, that's good. Let's 
scoots. Scoots the burbs. It's in the Growlithe. In a Dusk Bull. Interesting. Oh yeah, we're getting a uh, a regional variant of Growlithe in the in the next game. Pokemon Legends Arceus, or Arceus, however you pronounce it. <laughs> Arse. <laughs> the looks of things, it looks like it's going to be a, a rock type. I wonder if it's going to be pure rock or if they're going to keep the fire typing as well. Uh, we shall see. Well, it looks like a lot of people are surprise trading right now. Anthony. Why are you brushing hair out of your eyes? You have no hair in front of your face. Right, we get a whooper. Whoop whoop. <laughs> All right, last three. I'm trading with poop just now. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> okay. Charles. And Charles sends us a Mimikyu. God, I have so many Mimikyus and so many different types of Apricorn balls. Must have a 6 IV Mimikyu at this point. Kind of want to check to see if I do. Uh, where's my 6 IV box? Uh, 6 IVs. There we are. <laughs> Mimikyu in a love ball. Awesome. Alright, let's get back into the box. There we go. You just get so many Mimikyus through surprise trade. It's crazy. Alright, sending to Carmen. Oh my god, Carmen San Diego. Oh wow, a Mime Junior. Nice. So that could end up being a Mr. Rhyme. Alright. And last one in the box. Looks like Bren might be my last trade partner for the night. What do you got for us, Bren? If you are in fact the last trade partner, I don't know. <laughs> I just see the names pop up on the side of the screen and think, ooh, maybe I'll trade with them. Come on. Come on, hurry up. Get a move on. Get on with it. Okay, there we go. <laughs> So sending Charmander to Bren. What is Bren sending us in return? Oh wow, a call for Squire. Okay.
All right, so let's take a look at what we just got there, man. Probably not going to decide on a full team right now. I'm going to leave that for when I have a bit of time. What what jumps out at me? What do I fancy? Hmm. Knowing that Dynamaxes aren't legal at the moment. What would I want to run, I wonder? So many fire types in here. You've got Scorbunny, you've got Torkoal, Charmander, Vulpix, Growlithe. Hmm. Yeah, like I say, I'll, I'll give it some thought a bit later on. I don't really want me making any rash decisions um, right now. I don't want to push myself into making some terrible choices. Oh, what? Yeah, Litwick is another fire type. I think I might actually go for that as my, as my fire type in the team. But again, uh, I will make my choices at a later date. Yeah, I think I'll wrap up the stream here. I've been going for five and a half hours. I've done plenty tonight. I've opened a couple of boxes of Digimon cards. I've booked a wrestling pay-per-view. I attempted to start a Mario Kart tournament and I played a few matches of online Pokemon. So all in all, I think I've done quite a bit tonight. Tomorrow night, I'm hoping will be a return to Monster Rancher. Not sure how much of the game is left. I'm hoping to get it done soon though, so I can start working another playthrough. Yeah, I kind of want to keep to one playthrough at a time. We'll see how we'll see how things go. Right, thank you for everyone who stuck around at any point during the stream. Thanks for watching. See you again tomorrow. Take care. Happy CM Punk Day.